when you take Jim Crow to war, you kind of have this ability to create the other. Right, and and, the, and that otherness already, in many regards, already existed, which I think you're absolutely right. Um, but I think this gets me gets back to the question that we've been kind of dancing around that we haven't answered. If societies go to war, and we've talked about how these societies both have their hangups, do you fight the society? Because the firebombings in Tokyo appears to be we're fighting the societies, not necessarily the war machine itself. Now you can. They're trying to bomb a, a, a plant, but um, when we look at some of these other bombings, these are blatant, just we're going to bomb Tokyo. Now, is that okay? It'll lead to it depends. I mean, it doesn't really depend. But does it? it? I mean, hold on a second. You say it leads to capitulation. Mm -hmm. It no, doesn't. No, I'm saying if it does. Because okay. there are some states that simply don't care about its masses. In which case, no, this would be entirely unjustified. Right. But okay. in, in a democratic state, that said, a democratic state typically doesn't go to war against another democratic state, the government is to some degree beholden to its population. So you assume that if egregious violations are occurring against the population, the state's more inclined to capitulate. Okay, Andrew? Well, uh, the strategic bombing survey after World War II showed that um, strategic bombing of enemy populations really didn't do anything to make anybody capitulate. In reality, it really had the opposite effect. It strengthened the resolve of these uh, yeah, the bombing of Britain, bombing of Germany, stuff like that. So what it really comes down to is, like, these bombings aren't effective, but why are we still doing it? Because we're waging war against an enemy civilization, an enemy society, as opposed to just pursuing capitulation. It's total war. But if, it, yeah, total war. So if we're going, if, if we accept, Devin, is this Major Lee, my office mate, has said that, um, give him a shout-out on C-SPAN. Um, <laughs> if we accept this notion that societies are going to war, do we, are wars then against societies? 